Good evening. I'm Superintendent Lou Lopes, and I want to welcome everyone to our class of 2018 high school graduation. Tonight we have a special treat. Before we welcome our 2018 graduates, please join me in welcoming, welcoming back some of our graduates from the past 50 years. Starting with the graduates from 1968 to 1977. Next are graduates from 1978 to 1987. Alumni from 1988 to 1997. Nineteen ninety eight to two thousand and seven. And finally, from 2008 to 2017. And now join me in welcoming the Southeastern class of 2018.
was watching. <laughs> so it's you, you are wonderful. I mean, I should play billiards. <laughs> Good evening. My name is Dave Deegan, and I am proud and honored to say that I am the principal of Southeastern. <laughs> On the behalf of the administration, students, and staff, I would like to welcome all of you to tonight's graduation ceremony. Would you please rise? I would like to ask our salutatorian, Alyssa Trumbull, to come to the stage to lead us in a moment of silence in the Pledge of Allegiance. And would you please remain standing for our national anthem. Tonight we are dedicating our moment of silence to one of our own, Daniela Perez, who we tragically lost two years ago. I would ask everyone to please bow our heads in honor of Daniela and to reflect upon the people in your lives and the ones we have lost, a moment of silence. Now if you could please join me for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Would David Reed please come to the stage to lead us in the national anthem.
I would like to begin tonight's graduation ceremony by welcoming the family and friends of our graduates. It's very difficult to be a good student without a strong support system, and I'm sure that everyone in the audience has played a role in our graduate success. I would also like to welcome the members of our school committee who are in attendance tonight, our superintendent, Mr. Lewis Lopes, our wonderful staff, and the many alumni who came back to be part of our 50th anniversary graduation. Lastly, I'd like to welcome the most important people in attendance tonight, our class of 2018 graduates. In 1960, representatives from the geographical area that is known as the Southeastern Regional School District discussed the feasibility of establishing a regional vocational technical school. And in September of 1961, recommended to the Massachusetts Department of Education that such a regional school district should be established. In June of 1963, the Planning Board published its original proposal for our school. The Southeastern Regional School District broke ground on July 2nd, 1965, and completed construction just prior to opening on September 6th, 1967. The foresight of a handful of individuals almost 60 years ago set in motion a chain of events that bring us here tonight to celebrate our 50th anniversary graduation. <laughs> Times were different then, and the Southeastern of today looks and feels very different in its original model. Back in the 1960s and 70s, the Southeastern was much more of a boys trade school where students came to learn hard trades and then got a job. Over time and through the decades, industries, technologies, and the demographic makeup of our society has changed dramatically. Instead of getting locked in the past, Southeastern has always been a pioneer in bringing forth a forward-thinking educational model and highly relevant vocational offerings. We are a school of many opportunities, a very diverse student population, and our class of 2018 includes almost as many females as males. <laughs> yes, we have changed, but we have changed for the better. Today we offer a, the full high school experience that includes a wi wide variety of sports, student clubs, organizations, and activities. Our 21 vocational programs align the educational model that students are received high expectations of industry and our academic coursework perfectly prepares our students for the rigors of college. Because we've been proactive instead of reactive, striving instead of static, and inclusive of all who want to learn, today's Southeastern boasts our largest student population ever, and I am proud to say that today we will be awarding diplomas to 326 students, our largest graduating class in our 50-year history. Yeah. Class of 2018, you've had the opportunity to spend your last four years in our amazing school. You've used your time wisely, productively, and benefited from all that's been offered. But high school is the first step of a career in a lifetime. You must now take all of these lessons and, and become the person that you truly can be. I would like to share with you the words of William Shakespeare who said, our doubters are traitors, and they make us lose the good we might off win by faring to attempt. Class of 2018, strive to be amazing, articulate, thoughtful, and kind. Change your world and ours. Leave your mark, never settle, and above all, be true to yourself. I am highly confident that great things await you. Thank you. Our first speaker tonight is the superintendent of the Southeastern Regional School District, Mr. Lewis Lopes. On behalf of the entire Southeastern community, it is my honor to congratulate the class of 2018. Tonight you join the rank of over 13,000 individuals who can call themselves graduates from Southeastern Regional Vocational Technical High School. Some of them are here tonight. I had the pleasure of spending some time with them this afternoon, hearing their wonderful stories 
and giving them a tour of our school. They all said more or less the same thing. I wish we had this when we came here. Wow. Then many spoke about how Southeastern has been such a positive springboard in their careers and life. So tonight, we celebrate our past, but more importantly, we look forward to our future, and you are our future. We are proud of you. Your family and friends are proud of you, and you should be proud of yourself. Whether you realize it or not, you cross the stage today not only ready to begin the next chapter of your life, but with a real competitive advantage. You have choices. You have the skills that employers are looking for and willing to pay for. You have the vision and drive that college and the military want. You are college and career ready. That is your competitive advantage. The past 13 years have brought you here tonight, poised and ready to be productive citizens and to do something with yourself that matters, something that you are passionate about. Just like your high school years, your future will not always be easy, but the fact that you're here today is a testament to your ability to overcome obstacles and complete something that you set out to do. So I leave you with an inspirational quote. Believe in yourself and all that you are. Know that there is something inside of you that is greater than any obstacle. Congratulations, enjoy the evening, and thank you for choosing Southeastern. Next, I would like to welcome to the stage the chair of the school committee, Mr. Stephen Uden. Good evening. We're going to need some audience participation a little bit during my speech. So bear with me. You have two choices. I've composed two speeches tonight specifically for us. I have one called Really Long Speech, <laughs> right? And then I have this one that's about four or five minutes. So we've, we've installed a sophisticated decibel meter and if you like this one, scream out and clap. And now the really long speech. Oh, you guys are buzz killers. We're not having the long one. All right, thank you. You've, you've chosen wisely, I think. Um, thank you very much. I'd like to thank the Cosmetology and Design Department for bringing such a really good looking crowd tonight, uh, especially those of you who are dressed exactly the same. It's, it's really good to see everybody here tonight. Thank you, especially parents and family. I'd like to thank you all for being here. And just to uh, get a little business out of the way, the school committee is responsible primarily for three things. Oversight of the budget, uh, assistance to the superintendent and oversight, and we're the policy-making body of the school, but we do it in concert with laws and subject matter experts. Unofficially, we're also a group that oversees our own matters of the heart because we genuinely care for you students as best as we can with the resources that we have, ultimately respecting you and your privacy. You will not always see what the individuals on the school committee our staff, faculty, and administration are capable of doing with us. But in the background, kindness, concern, and generosity sometimes bursts like geysers at Yellowstone Park when we need it. Right now, I'd like to take a moment to ask any students that have signed up and are joining the military to stand up so we may thank them for the day that we're having like this that are so rare around the world. Could you please stand up for a minute, please? Thank you. 
The work you're going to do is making a lot of things possible for families, and, and we really are grateful and blessed by your service. I'd also like to introduce the school committee and the towns they represent quickly. If uh, each person would stand up. I'm not sure if Colleen is here. I don't think she was able to make it. But Colleen Maloney represents West Bridgewater. Robin Zoll represents Stoughton. Mindy Kempner represents the great town of Sharon. Joseph Joe Dutcher, East Bridgewater. Dennis Feely from Norton. Yeah, let your town have it, that's good. Mark Lindy from Brockton. Tony Branch from Brockton. <laughs> Mr. William Bill Flannery from Mansfield. Mike Petrowski from Easton. One more board member that we have who doesn't vote but it's very special to us this year is Tom Coughlin. Tom, could you stand up for a minute? Where are you? There you are. Stay, stay, well, Tommy, stay standing, because if friends or loved ones are watching you, I want them to hear this. Tom presented it to us on the board every meeting that we had, which were very exciting meetings. And his cons he would talk about the concerns, accomplishments of the students. And we loved those updates. They were always very, very inclusive. The only thing about Tom was that when he presented, sometimes we would have to remind him or pull like a tooth from him his own accomplishments. Tom is a very, very, very professional and admirably humble young man. Thank you, Tom. Please sit down. Okay, here we go. This is the main part of the speech. This is called a congratulations speech. And what we, the committee, hope is that even as you wrap up your high school education, we all learn a little something or two this evening to take away as the great wide open spreads before you our treasured young graduates and those we love or will love when the time is right. The entomology of the word congratulations is Latin. And if you break it up, con of congratulations means with or together. And gratulare means to give thanks or so show joy. So together, we are giving thanks and showing joy. But I'm not sure that we're here as much to congratulate you tonight on what you've accomplished up to this point. I think what we hope on the board is to congratulate you more for what you're going to do in the future. That's what we're proud of, is your future, like our alumni over there. Thank you very much for that. Now, graduates, here's another interesting nugget. The hats on your head are called mortarboards. If you didn't know that, yeah, they're an old symbol of one of the core goals of this school, they're based on the mason's tool that hold the cement when they build strong uh, structures. It's also now a symbol to learn of being a lifelong learner. It's a symbol of learning. So for some, that may be using the Pythagorean theorem, others as mastering an aspect of your program of study, but it can also be to learn about yourself. The darn thing is an actual thinking cap. It's the thinking cap. Keep it around someplace to remind yourself that learning is not about being a robot. That's programming. Learn to ask for help and get out of or not get into situations your gut tells you you shouldn't be in. You're equipped to do that. And as time goes by, you'll get better at it. Have faith in yourself and others. It won't always be perfect, 
but at some point you will know it's time to learn something new and better for you and others, even if that means doing nothing in some situations. Sometimes doing nothing is better than doing the wrong thing. Yeah. yeah. So there's a little trick I want to tell you about, I hope you can take with you for the rest of your life. Whenever you're out there in the world, look for the color red or a curve. And whenever you see that, understand that the human brain actually likes the color red and recognizes curves. And whenever you see the color red or a curve, think about doing something nice for yourself or someone else. It actually happens every time brake lights come on in front of you or even right now where you're sitting. Let's, let's use that as a little tool. It doesn't have to be huge or dramatic. You don't have to save the world. It could just be simple as holding the door or giving someone a smile or even smiling at yourself in the mirror or turning in sunglasses you find at the movies. Who cares? Just as long as it's good. Trust me, it works like a good laugh and it feels good even for a little while. So, one more audience participation. Graduates, this is for you. Look for someone you care about 360 degrees on this property right now. Stand up, blow them a kiss, pound your heart, and congratulate them for getting you here. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's get to the let's get let's sit down now. I probably blew this thing out of the water. Come on. Your family loves you. They got the picture. All right. So again, look for that color red, look for that curve, use that little tool to make your little light shine and thinking about doing the right thing for others and yourself. In conclusion, we congratulate you from the bottom of our hearts here on the school committee and pray that God will bless you through your lives when the time is right for it. Have faith. So let's get one step closer to getting our diplomas. Thank you very much. God bless you all. We love you. For our last speaker of the evening, it's my honor and pleasure to introduce your valedictorian, Margaret Nissender. My fellow classmates, this is it. This is the moment in which we can look around at all of our friends in their caps and gowns and at all of our families and teachers looking on with proud eyes and say we've made it. We've made it all the way through. <laughs> it's been a good handful of years since we all made the decision to attend Southeastern as eighth graders, or perhaps for transfer students such as myself, as freshmen, as sophomores, as juniors even, but no matter how many years it's been for each of us as individuals, whether you committed in the seemingly ancient days past of middle school, or whether, to you, Southeastern still seems like a fresh new start, what common theme lies between us is that we all made a choice. The Southeastern Regional School District covers nine cities and towns, all of which contain their own public high schools. Each and every one of us had the choice to attend one. Some of us, for a year or two, did attend one. But in the end, we all ended up here as Southeastern's graduating class of 2018, not Mansfield's or Brockton's or Easton's. So why here? I'm sure the answer differs at least a bit between everyone, their individual stories as to why they chose Southeastern over anywhere else. And though I technically currently speak for the class of 2018, I cannot actually speak for the class of 2018 as a whole. Though we stand as one, we're all quite different and we've all followed our own paths up to now. Not all of us chose to join for the same reasons, but I can certainly tell you what the reason was for me. I chose to attend Southeastern because to me, a vocational technical education offers so much more. Think about our lives. 
about what we've done every day up until now. We wake up, we come to school, and we work. We work in specialized fields, learning standards and techniques and business practices. We work towards our licenses, our certifications, our next step up into the big, wide, undoubtedly terrifying real world. Those out on co-op work for real, clocking in in the morning and receiving regular payment for the skills that their shop has trained them in, serving not only as a physical, monetary reward, but as a personal accomplishment, a confirmation of their qualifications and an add-on to their experience in the field. And then, once we're finished being nurses, carpenters, plumbers, designers, actors, directors, etc., <laughs> we switch back to being students. We have academic classes to attend and to strive to pass along with our shop duties, five classes a day, five days a week, some of which, for those who qualify, are college-level classes. We've powered through MCAS and AP testing despite having half the time granted to regular public school students to study, to prepare, to absorb two weeks worth of curriculum every other week. Students at Southeastern lead double lives, balancing a life of academia with preparations for a career plan. And if that's anything at all, it's certainly not easy. And yet we've all made it. We managed to scramble through double the duties in half the time, these caps upon our heads standing as silk trophies, our reward for making it through. As your class valedictorian, I could stand here and go on about an endless bounty of opportunities and how they lie before us and how we need to have both faith in ourselves and faith in the future, but there's no need for that because we're already there. Those who are licensed, who have internships and apprenticeships and jobs in the field, who have joined firms and organizations and offices, who plan on furthering their technical training, who have been accepted to colleges and to institutes and to universities, <laughs> and who plan on traversing farther down their path or perhaps changing their path altogether, you're in the future. You're one step ahead of the game, standing with a foot crammed in the door that leads to your success. It's true, though, that we have no way of knowing what the far future holds the future 20 or 30 or 50 years from now. No matter your passion, your drive, whether or not you feel that you have one, there's no guarantee that you'll stay on the same road forever. The thought can be intimidating, for sure, but my advice to you, my fellow classmates, is to find comfort in that ambiguity. Strive to come to the full realization that you can't predict the future, that no one can, and rather than fearing the unknown, Use it as an excuse to fully live in the moment, to chase your dreams and hone your skills and do what you love. Because we'll never know what the far future holds, why not give our dreams a shot while we still can? Thank you. <laughs> I would like to thank Alyssa and David and Margaret for the great job they did up here on stage today. <laughs> Graduates, before we begin the awarding of diplomas, I have just one thing that I need you to do. After the last member of your class receives the diploma, I know that you'll all be very excited. But before you let loose, throw your caps, and greet each other and your families, I need about one minute to certify you as graduates before the celebration can be begin. At this time, I'd like to ask Superintendent Lopes and the members of the school committee to come forward for the presentation of diplomas. Graduate. 
And now, the graduates from Advertising and Design, your valedictorian, Margaret Elizabeth Nistendurk. Matthew Kyle Anderson. Julie Ann Audette. Cassidy Rose Banford. Paul Anthony Christian Jr. Willow Rose Culp. <laughs> Evelyn Grace Gabrielle. <laughs> Shania Latassi Green. Jordan Eric Greenidge. <laughs> Jennifer Ann Jerome. <laughs> Brittany Angela Moon. Timothy Martin Mullen Single. Normand Pierre Louis. Amber Lily Purrington. Evelyn Florence Ryder. <laughs> Salvatore William Spacco. <laughs> Gregory Eugene Stone Jr. <laughs> Ty J, Luis Texera. <laughs> Hannah Marie Williams. <laughs> and now, the graduates from Automotive Technology, yeah. Francis John yeah. Atkinson. Sayer Bazil. Yeah. Ryan Michael Bethany. <laughs> Benjamin Chaplin. Kevin Cologne Bermudez. Thomas Anthony Thomas Anthony Cotton. Josue DeCuna. Paige Ellen Dacey. Look at you! 
Ielsen DeJoy DePina. Jamie Miguel Fernandez. Giovanni Edmund Fraga. Jamie Hadley. Christopher Mark McCourt. Samuel Alexander McPhee. Erin Elizabeth Murray. Angel Luis Ocasio Jr. John Paul Lewis Rivera. Dominic Antero Rodriguez. Jimson Nicholas Shannon. Joshua Mark Smith. Damani David Wright. And now, the graduates from Business and Marketing, Gianni Tali Calderon Hampton. <laughs> Christian Dorsina. Brianna Gonzalez. Kiara Desreen Kidd. Kelly Jean. Kelly Jean the Box. Kelly Jean Lapointe. Larry Andrade Lopes. Okay. Yeah, Larry. <laughs> Ariana Marie McCarthy. Marion Nelly Mejia. Salvatore Angelo Munifo. Michael John O'Neill. Michael John O'Neill. Natea Qualls Leslie. Janessa Rodriguez. Louis David Vasquez. Louis David Vasquez. Marcelo Vicente. Crystal Alexandria Wright. Yeah. 
And now, the graduates from Carpentry, Kyle Benito. Delcano Cintron. Brian Thomas Cohen. Gerardo Joseph Dorleen. Gina Eugene. Ethan Daniel Garino. Angel Alejandro Mancortes. Cade Jesse Mitchell. Mario Oliveira Jr. Kyle Nogueira Ibuki. Kyle Nogueira Ibuki. Kyle Nogueira Ibuki. Kyle Nogueira Rutledge Taylor. David Michael White. <laughs> Timothy Duncan White. And now the graduates from Collision Repair and Restoration, Sean Adrian Adorno. Chauncey Jaden Antunes Lock. Yeah. Hurley Berlard. Yeah. Isaiah Montero Fox. Jamari Gonsalves. <laughs> Isaiah Gutierrez Montero. Isaiah Anthony Guzman. Philip Brian Lafon. Giovanni Medeiros. Nathan Noah Ramos. You know my name, right? Joshua Alves Rodriguez. Joshua Alves Rodriguez. And now the graduates from Computer and Electronic Engineering, Nathan Owen Brennan. Andrew Scott Brown. Andrew Scott Brown. Dominic Caulfield Diverger. Joshua Peter Caveney. Dylan Conrad Cook. Dylan Conrad Cook. 
McCormick Denicott Delaney. Edward Patrice Dorelian. James Patrick Foy. Chris John Lopes. Kiernan Michael McKay. Bruno D. Marino. Bruno! James Glenn Morgan. Cameron Francis O'Brien. There you go, Cam. Angel Luis Perea. Andrew William Pimentel. Chase Joshua Purcell. Derek Anthony tomorrow. Derek Anthony tomorrow. Michael Volpe. Anthony David Walsh. Benjamin James Weeks. Benjamin James Weeks. And now, the graduates from cosmetology, Megan Elizabeth Berry. Victoria. Esperanza Berganza. <laughs> Fallon Bonnie. <laughs> Angela Patrice Braddock. Natalie Miranda DePina. <laughs> Eliani DePina Montron. <laughs> Sabrina Floraval. Jessica Paige Hanning. <laughs> Destiny Angelina Desiree Inez Lamar. <laughs> Zamira Michelle Luke. Amanda Marie McCarthy. Elizabeth Galveo Ribeiro. Julia Michelle Ritchie. Ariana Lachey Selby Jones. And now 
now the graduates from Culinary Arts, Desea Monet Baker. Emmanuel Cardoso Barros. <laughs> Samantha Jane Dirt. <laughs> Essence Frederick Ekman. Justin Thomas Frucci. <laughs> Rihanna Elise Gonsalves. <laughs> Queen Elizabeth Johnson. Deja Precious Lopes. <laughs> Alito George Martin. Iani. Malicioso. Jasmine Iani. Malicio Soros. Mandy Yo, Jane yeah, Michelli. Matt Miller. Larry Maracu. Asha Marie Molin. Jovan Montero. Lined Naika Petit Ferrer. Willow Elizabeth Ricketson. Yes, Willow! Cassandra Helena Rivera. Connor Donovan Rogan. Byron William Shoemaker. Melody Tong. Chanel Alexia Mayoko Tucker. Christy Villard. <laughs> Howard Paul Whitaker the <laughs> Third. Randall Anthony Williams. <laughs> and now. The graduates from dental assisting, Rainice Nicole Alberti. Yeah! Yeah! Alicia Silvera Alves. Yeah! Kayla Michelle Alves. Sabrini Basil. Sarah. 
Laura Casimir. Cheyenne Arena Johnson. <laughs> Amanda McCooch. <laughs> Unique Ariana Desravine. Okay, Ace Lynn. Ace Lynn Yep. That's all right. Good, because I read something wrong. Aislinn Alexandra Osborne. Brenda Pereira. Brenda Pereira. Olivia Pires Andres. Olivia Pires Andres. Crystal Rosado. Rosado? Crystal Rosado. <laughs> Raylene Santiago. Aaliyah Wright. And now, the graduates from Precision Machining, Mateus Barbosa de Moraes. Benjamin Granger Benjamin Granger Hebshi Jr. William John Lembo. Eric Scott McLaughlin. Ryan Gabriel Vasquez. Tyler Patrick Williams. And now, the graduates from HVAC and refrigeration, your salutatorian, Alyssa Elizabeth Trumbull. Jonathan Richard Benoit. Benoit. Yeah. Jonathan Richard Benoit. <laughs> Troy Michael Butler, Jr. Jessica Ann Chabray. Danielle Marie Craig. Nicholas Gerard Damon. Joshua Daniel DeChico. DeChico. Yeah, DeChico. DeChico. Joshua Daniel DeChico. Tyler Patrick Doherty. Marshall Charles Jacquet. Marshall Charles Jacquet. Marco Charles Duquette. Kaylee Lynn Ferreira. Haley Lynn Ferreira. Sarah Rao. Michael Anthony Reedy. Eric. Matthew Eric Riley. Kyle David Rebusell. Yeah. 
Carly Lorraine Smith. And now, the graduates from Early Education and Child Care, Garland's David Ambrose. Elizabeth Cruz Bota. <laughs> Haley Kogan. <laughs> Maya Elizabeth Ann Costa. <laughs> Victoria Grace Dalton. Melanie Medina de Pina. Julia Ina Francois. Julia Ina. Ina. Julia Ina Francois. Yes. Julia Ina. Yep, my hat's gonna fall off. Julia Ina Francois. You know me. Shaki Monique Gallimore. A Shaki Monique Gallimore. This is Kevin Hippolyte. Hippolyte. Yeah, that's easy. Yeah. Kevin Hippolyte. Crystal Celine Jocks. Crystal Celine Jocks. Michaela Eileen Murphy. Michaela Eileen Murphy. Megan Louise O'Brien. <laughs> Jordan O'Shea. <laughs> Esmeria Serrano. <laughs> Ashley Tangelini. Brittany Terrio. And now, the graduates from Electrical, Scott Albertson. James John Babb. Jao Barbosa. Milton Barbosa. Milton Barbosa. Lila Nache Boyd. Lila Nache Boyd. Sean Michael Cavanaugh. Cameron John Derry. James DeRose. Lacey Ann Duquette. You know that. Lacey Ann Duquette. Benjamin Alex Feldman. Benjamin Alex Feldman. <laughs> Diana Sophia Lopes Fernandez. <laughs> Jalea Rihanna Green. <laughs> Patrick Dante Henry. Fran Johnson Jr. Alan James Larkin. Yeah. 
Alan James Larkin. Kendrick Isaiah oh, yeah. Lalonde. Brandon Painter. Brandon Painter? Yeah. Brandon Painter. Yeah. Eric Sokolowski. Sokolowski. Yeah. Go get that done. Eric Sokolowski. Jacob Allen Sotham. Jacob Allen Topham. Yeah. And now, the graduates from Environmental and Biotechnology, Deja Marie Alvarado. Rebecca Amor. Anthony Arias. Maya Candria Cannell. Erin Marie Disharon. Jacob Alexander Glennon Walsh. Lauren Elizabeth Kent. Andrea Danielle Lovering. Joshua McNulty. Eva Rose Miller. <laughs> Sam Henry Pipes. <laughs> Jelani Ramos Pires. Lauden Ariana Pormaz. Yes, Lauden! Ivan Kutso Lucina. Ivan Crystal Racinos. <laughs> Fabiola Jude Solomon. And now, the graduates from Graphic Communications, Ashley King. Kaylee Ellen Moore. Haley Ellen Morris. <laughs> Makaya Thorencio. And now, the graduates from Health Services, Jasmine Nadine Andre. Christina DeAndre Fernandez. Lindsay Marie Holmes. Elissa Gomes Mendez. <laughs> Dina Bell Montero. <laughs> Erica Dos Anjos Montero. Blaze 
Ms. Alexander Osborne. Malena Paola. Zayobi Raymond. It's Kayla DePino Day. Oh my God. Kayla DePina uh, Ribeiro. Isabel Lee Robin. Tatiana Tavares Rodriguez. Talia Scott. Jenny Layla Toussaint. And now the graduates from Legal and Protective Services, Jaden Joseph Andre. Jasenia Avila Ortiz. You made it sound like that. Elsie Cabral Gomez. This Elsie Cabral Gomez. What is it? Ellison Cabral Gomez. Ellison Cabral Gomez. It's Tanea Crystal Cutlers. Tanea Crystal Cutlers. Tanea Crystal Cartwright. Michaela Janelle Cashman. Craig Robert Shimolinski. Shimolinski? Shimolinski. Craig Robert Shimolinski. Marlon Lopes Dos Santos. Joshua William Costa Fashion. Joshua William Costa Faustino. Daniel Joseph Ford. Haley Rosara Gill. Kelsey Rose Graham. Erwin Sanchez Intent. Kobe J. Von Jones, full name. What is it? Kobe J. Von Jones, full name. Kobe J. Von Jones Fernandez. Jordan Matthew May. Jordan Matthew May. Dania McBrayer. Jamaya McConnell. Is it messed up? Renee McDade. Taylor Marie Murphy. Christopher Pinheiro. Mairead Rose Pratt. Dariani Lija Mendez Rodriguez. <laughs> Jessica Lynn Shea. I don't have a card, but my name is Taylor Marie Sally. You know my name. Taylor Marie Spinelli. Taylor Marie Spinelli.
Minnelli. Gabrielle Cheryl Sylvester. Gabrielle Chanel Sylvester. <laughs> Caleb Alexander Wolfert. And now the graduates from medical assisting, Chris Mary Andre. Cassandra De Rosa. Jocelyn Fernandez Dos so Do Santos. Juliana Francois. Sir Lea Gonsalves. <laughs> Maria Yolanda Guamensela. <laughs> Annalisa Evelyn Noel Johnson. Kayla Looney. <laughs> Brittany Mendez Lope. Vasana Marquez. Dulce Oresti. Yeah. Eunice Ribeiro Pinto. Mackenzie <laughs> Taylor Sullivan. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm graduating. <laughs> Mackenzie Taylor Sullivan. Tanya Medina Vas Garcia. Abigail Carmen Velasquez. Abigail Carmen Velasquez. Kayla Marie Wright. Kayla Marie Wright. Metal Fabrication, Jeffrey David Blood Jr. And now, the graduates from Metal Fabrication, Jeffrey David Blood, Jr. Lucas D'Souza. Joseph C. Frigo. No Christopher, just Jake Huey. Jake Huey? It was good, what a cup. Jake Huey. Awesome. Steven Francis Kelly. Steven Francis Kelly. Oh. Pat, Pat Meehan or Patrick Meehan? Patrick Meehan. Oh. Was that Bobby? Patrick Meehan. <laughs> Malik Tina. Malik Pina. Dustin Coleman Rosenfield. Dustin Coleman Rosenfield. Callie Jessica Royer. Devin Joseph Angelopoulos, and I'm in Pullman first name. And now the graduates from plumbing, Devin Joseph Angelopoulos. Tanner William Bryan. <laughs> Kyle Andrew Burns. <laughs> 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 
Nicholas Anthony Del Tufo. Jose Cardoso Jr. Alex Eve Doriska. Kevin Paulo Fernandez. Kevin Hume. Evan Hume. Thomas Robert LeBlanc. Charles Stephen Marcellinus. Marcellinus? Yep. Charles Stephen Marcellinus. Nicholas Ty Mopo. Mopo? Mopo. Nicholas Ty Mopo. Dylan Anthony Rogers. Andrew Joseph Senesi. Andrew Joseph Senesi. Andrew Joseph Senesi. Lucas Joseph Sinclair. Alexander Kenneth the Bird. The Bird. Alexander Kenneth the Bird. Jillian Ann Tibbets. Arvin Vojang. Arvin Vojang. Arvin Vojang. Brian Valentin Soto. William Welch. John Francis Winterly. And now the graduates from Video and Performing Arts. Jayla Alexis Alves Andre. Christopher Matthew Ferretti. <laughs> Wilmer Francisco Castillo. <laughs> Thomas Ryan Coughlin. Drew James DeMarino. <laughs> <laughs> Drew James DeMarino. Thank you, Mr. Cross. I'm going to cry, Mr. Cross. Come in here. Camillo Giangrande the fourth. Ashley Alicia John Baptiste. Ariana Eve Jenks. Savannah Rose Lee. Hunter Maynez. Hunter Edward Massery. <laughs> Adamir Baptista Montero. Yeah. Eduardo Gabriel Malouche Oliveira.
David Lee Reed. David Lee Reed. Cut me off. <laughs> Jacob Daniel Rodenbush. Julianne Olivia Taylor. The last component of our graduation ceremony is we certify our graduates. <laughs> Teachers, graduates, please take your tassel and move it from the right side to the left side of your cap. It's my honor and pleasure to certify you as graduates of the Southeastern Regional Vocational Technical High School. Thank you, good night. <laughs>